What's up guys? Welcome back to another cool content channel. Matthew Nia is back here. Why do I have my shirt off though? Show my ripped abs. Okay, well, two, long story short, got in two crashes, major crashes. It's not what the video is about, but just want to let you guys know what happened. So, Monday, this happened. Where's that? So, this is a big wooden berm to another big wooden berm. I mean, ramp, ramp to ramp. Six foot gap. If you miss the gap, six feet gap, you die. So basically, this is me. This is me, splat, dead, broken thumb. I didn't think I broke it, but it looks pretty big. So yeah, that's what happened. And uh, what happened from that one? This happened, and this happened. So all this happened from that crash. And also look at my thumbs. <laughs> look at the difference on them. The right one is the bad one. So that's what happened on what? What was that? Monday. Now, here comes Wednesday. Kristen got me a sick longboard. So sick. Don't have it here. It's in my truck. Sick one. Then, today, this is where this happened. Got none of this on video. They didn't get the crash on video. But I will show you the video of me clearing it the first time. Because I cleared it the first time. Good jump, right? <laughs> so, I'll show you the first time I cleared it. But the second time, this is what happened. I crashed. But I'll show you the clip of me clearing it. This one, I got no... video at all of course so i don't you guys don't know I, i'm gonna say vista park because you guys probably most of you guys know it vista park and davy so i was going down that steep asphalt right when you go into vista there's a big steep asphalt probably like what like 60 feet high maybe higher 100 feet and it just goes straight down and when you're on a long board you're like uh, 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 uh. so that's bad so i was going this is me steep down so splat dead watch what happened Nobody needs to know. Oh, no, show. You gotta show. It's not butt fox. <laughs> that one. Pull up your pants. Oh, you see my butt crack? No, show. There. And then. Oh, you can't even see it because there's yellow stuff. Then look at my knee. My knee's hurting right now. <laughs> so, yeah, that's what happened. Just want to let you guys know. Um, skateboard, mountain bike crash, freaking off it, bro. Freaking almost died. So now let's get into whatever this video is playing. Oh god, I'm in it. Alright guys, peace. What is up guys? So, <laughs> this is where the video is taking. We got something new for the channel. Let's get into it. What this so beast is. So what we got here is a beast of a boat. This is that famous, most loved hole of a boat. You know what it is guys. I don't know if you can tell yet. But you can maybe tell from the T-top. Sorry, the conditions of this video is going to be a little crazy. Can you tell now? Yes. An Intrepid 327. Woo! That beauty. So as you guys can tell, we already took off the sticker. The liquid therapy. That's the name of the boat. It's already gone. Because we're going to re-stick the sticker the whole boat. We're going to do quite a few mods. But first, let me tell you what this boat is. I'm going to tell you what the boat is. And as it sits right now. And then I'm going to tell you what we're going to do to it. Just fits. Look how, oh, just fits in here, man. So, let's get it. All right, so this is a 32.7, yes. A 33 or a 32, you say it. 327 Intrepid, 2016 hole. Mint condition, like clean as crap. But we're going to repaint it all. I'm going to tell you now, but it's mint. Like, look, look at this paint. Oh! Um, took off the big sticker and the thumbnail. You see the big liquid therapy. Took it off. Um, powered by two 350 Merc Verados. They are 2016s too, I think. They only have a 350 hours um, left and right motor, each motor. It's a twin engine boat. Big, very big. You already know. Step ladder, side step ladder. Insane up boat upgrade that everyone needs. Um, what else we got? You know, I know a little bit about the boat. So, it has, as I said, 350 Mercury's, low hours, um, great lower units. I forgot what size these are. I think they're 28s. Mercury Eco Inertia. I just tapped it a little. Oh, right there. There they are. Uh, 16 pits are big props. So, now let's go inside the hole. You kind of see it already. So, all white. I'm going to tell you about the upgrades. So I just want to show you around the boat real quick. Pretty massive, pretty sick. Got a nice uh, electronic anchor. That's how it looks from the outside. Now let's go on the inside. And just look at this, dude. Just <laughs> look at all this space. So as you see right now, 
All the seats. So I can already tell what upgrades we're doing. All the upholstery is gone. All the seats are gone. So back here, big seat. All this is all upholstery, like all cushion. All that's cushion. All that's cushion. Um, so I actually might as well just tell you about the upgrades already. All this is cushion. All that's cushion. So yeah, so it's powered by all JL speakers. I'm kind of all over the place with this thing, but let's get into it. So I'm just going to tell you the upgrades and what this boat is. So this is all going to be new stitching. I'm trying to get a picture before what the stitching looked like. I'll pop it up. But we're going to do pretty much, I'm not mistaken, I think diamond stitch, uh, stitching, not sure. But I'll show you an aftermath of what, how this boat looks in another video. But I'm going to show you what before, what all this upholstery looks like. Uh, JL speakers all around. Uh, I think that's an eight over there. Uh, has a nice big seat here. Heck of seating. Nice big T-top. Nice windshield. Nice electronic anchor. Uh, what else we got here? Two big garments. Look like freaking flat screens here. Two big ones. Insane. Uh, all. Oh, it's so smooth. Beautiful. Seating back here with the cooler. That seat is beautiful. A seat right here. So seats everywhere. Nice step. Nothing really much to explain. The mercs are in mint condition. Um, so yeah, something to really explain. I mean, a big T-top up there, of course. I want to take you inside because the bathroom's pretty fresh. There's a bathroom in here. So that goes up and there's a bathroom in there. Don't know how to take it up, but I can show you the compartments at least. I don't know how to bring that up, honestly. A lot of compartments, a lot of storage everywhere. So now let's get into the upgrades of the video. So obviously we're doing all new upholstery, all new seating, cushions everywhere. Um, we're tuning those 350s to like 425 uh, Mercury tune, so they're gonna be 425s and 350s. Probably gonna put it around like 65 mile per hour boat. This whole ride's insane. There's another step ladder over here. Um, very smooth riding boat. We're gonna do a try, uh, uh, a test trial, of, like the how the water, how it sits on the water, and like we're gonna do a whole video of like on the water. And there's also gonna be another video in the long run when it's all upgraded, when the motors are all tuned, the seats are all in. This is the favorite feature. There's a freaking seat right here and a cooler. There's a the cockpit right there with big garments. Uh, what else upgrades we're going to do? So tune up um, all seating, like I said, a million times. The speakers sound awesome. Uh, powder coated white T-top already there. Looks insane. Um, so that's all pretty much the interior. It's everything. There's compartments everywhere. That's all we're going to do the interior and the motors. All right. Which is a lot of interior in the motors. And then on the outside, the let motors, me get down. By the way, like they're freaking minty. Minty. 300 hours each. All right. So what we're going to do on the outside of the boat. So all these stickers are going to be gone. So as you see, the big liquid therapy sign's gone. Um, it's going to be all white, pretty much. We're going to put a new rub rail. It's a little chipped everywhere, see? That white powder coat staying. I think we're going to do the top gray. If I'm not mistaken, gray top. White powder coat's going to stay like that. And this whole boat's going to be this white. All the way down. This blue's going to go. All that's going to be white. All the sticker's going to be gone, so it's white. And this is going to be gone. Might do a gray sticker that says Intrepid. That's going to be also the same. That whole motor is going to stay the same. Um, has a nice triaxle tire trailer. What else are we doing? So, yeah, that's all the upgrades. It sounds like a little bit, but it's actually a lot. I mean, that, it actually is a lot. Electronic anchor I showed you before. But, yeah, it's a beast. So, it's 30, uh, 30, 20, uh, 327, which is basically a 33, 32 Intrepid. Uh, great, smooth yeah, as guys, cool. I feel like I'm missing a lot of stuff that I missed on this boat. But that's pretty much the overhaul. I don't know all about this boat, but look what it has right here. You see that? Those are propellers. And the propellers, not only that, those little things, they make you turn your boat. So when you're going to go dock, you go to a nice restaurant with your girl, you can dock like no other. You'll dock, and so the water goes the other way, and the water comes this way. So it makes your boat just turn right into the dock. It's very easy docking with those things. And, of course, the step holes. Those what is it? Oh, no, it's a single step hole, but it's fucking big. It's a big ass step hole, actually. But yeah, insane. Um, So I think for like a middle slot stuff, but yeah. Insanely, like this rides better than what? What's a big hole that rides insanely good? Um, I guess a uh, contender CV, maybe? This rides better than a CV, pretty much. This is compared to a 39 CV, they say. This 327, 32 foot hole Intrepid makes, it's like the right amount of weight. The right amount of motor power, the right amount of everything, the right amount of um, big freaking sidewall beams. Look at the freaking, there's no, you're not getting wet at all. 
I can't wait to do the sea trial because we're gonna freaking when we go on this boat, we're gonna see if we get wet. We're gonna see how smooth it drives. But maybe maybe we'll have the tune by then because they're at three fifties. We have to get them to four twenty five. So because right now it only hits like fifty. It's a big boat with two motors. So we're hoping to get like the mid 60s, 63, 64 with this boat. Um. So yeah, guys, can't wait to see when it's all white. And then all that paint, all those stickers are all gonna go. It's gonna be smooth white with a gray top. The interior is gonna look magnificent. I can't wait to show you the interior. But yeah, man, that's that's the Intrepid. Great, beautiful boat. Insanely beautiful. I can't wait to take it in the next videos upcoming. But yeah, thanks guys. Thanks for watching this freaking beast. And thanks for watching the cool, can cool content channel. And thank you for supporting the coolest content channel. Like, thank you guys for the subs. I thank you. Hope you guys had a great New Year's and Christmas. And... Yeah, 2023 is going to be big. I hope, I hope to have a thousand subs by, uh, our goal is to get a thousand subs by the end of the year. I hope we can do it, guys. Cool content channel. We'll see you in the next one. Matthew Nunez out, guys. Thank you. All right, do it. He loves it. Do it again. Do it this way. He's on. He loves it. Look, he's balancing. Wow. Oh my God, how cute. Look at him go like this. He's, oh, so, so cute. Take off.